be glad with thy countenance. For the king trusted in the Lord God, and for the mercy of the Most High, he shall not be moved. Thy hand shall find out all thine enemies. Thy right hand shall find out those that hate thee. Rastafari is, some people would say, like a rereading of the Bible. The same book that has been used by Christians for 2,000 years. But we look at the scriptures and, and, and we read it in a perspective that is not tainted by 2,000 years of tradition. You know what I mean? So when we look at Exodus chapter 30 and you read about the holy anointing oil that was used by Moses, um, Kenebasim, which is an early version of the word cannabis, was a key ingredient in that oil. Revelation says the healing, the, the, the leaves of the tree shall be for the healing of the nations. We, as Rastafari, know that to be the herd. It was a great battle in April of 1930 um, when His Imperial Majesty um, would finally be victorious over the armies of the enemies of the Most High God, Jah. And it was Rastafari. You know, it's not, um, what's the word? Recreation. Cannabis is not that. Cannabis is something that puts you in contact with the spiritual aspect of, you know, of life, as you know, in the physical body. Decriminalization of ganja is one of the steps that Rastafari as a community has been advocating for globally. Um, decriminalization is not legalization, which is the ultimate conversation that we would want to hold. Money is being made on the same thing that people serve time for. Well, we're asking for the ones who serve time before they legalize it and everyone could smoke it and walk wherever, for them to give some form of compensation. Because these brothers and sisters came out with records. They were unable to work to this day. It's our sac sacrament. It's just a far as sacrament. Yes. So what about all those people in incarceration? You know, who've been locked up for this over the years, for doing so many years for selling these herbs. Because it's the herb. We are able to access a certain kind of connection with um, creation and that, that is ultimately um, the sacramental gift that we seek to defend. So I now must use it. It's the last. Yeah. <laughs>